center mid, anchored by Carlos Guerrezo and a front three of Kikanovich, Ibobasi, and Espinosa. Jimmy Maurer continues to start for an injured Martin Paz in goal. One change in the back line. Jose Martinez in for Sebastian Ibiaga. Their most recent home game was at Levi Stadium. Philip Dujic with the opening whistle. First touch of the ball by Ziki and Sabalang for FC Dallas. And off we go. Tyler O'Brien on the right side gives it away. Tackled off the feet of Yule and going for goal. First shot for FC Dallas by Alan Velasco. Forces Danielle into the save, diving to his right. Paul Marie out to Espinosa. Espinosa drives it across. That's over the leap of Benji Kikanovic. And a shot taken first time. That was good technique by Trauco. FC Dallas getting good numbers inside the box, looking to defend. But first of all, Jamiro Montero, that good run to the near post, drawing the defenders. And that's part of why. And then Paul Marie couldn't collect it on the right edge of the box. And here is Yule with a fistful of jersey and a yellow card with that foul right at the halfway line. The aforementioned Jackson Ewell to Montero, but it's Quinone who tackles it off his feet. Now coming forward is Obreon. Obreon has a goal and assist in the last two games. Ferreira has three goals in the last three. He's going to serve this back in after his first shot was denied, maybe partially by Danielle and partially by the woodwork. They don't link up. Well, here's that Jesus Ferreira chance. And how about that run? Looks to be just onside. And look, he does not need a lot of space to get that shot off. As noted earlier, San Jose, lowest shooting percentage in terms of shots on target in MLS this year. Just under 30%. O'Brien squares it. Ferreira on his preferred right foot. And he drives it into the first row behind. There's Philip Dujic, the referee. Blows the whistle. And Jeremy Abobasi starts... Second half action. Mark, you talked a lot about the similarities in Luchi Gonzalez and Nico Estevez. I, I, I continue to see a lot of similarities in these two teams and the way that they approach the game. Now here's Junka, sweeps it in the direction of Velasco, overlapped by Marco Farfan, and it's going to fall for Farfan. Daniello out off his line and prevents the opening goal of the game. Well, and take a look at this. Fortunate bounce. Farfan onside there. Daniel does well to read that ball, come off of his line, be as big as possible. If Farfan would have been on, he would have been in. Where the earthquakes, the attack on right now. FC Dallas got some numbers behind the ball. Trout go to a Bobasi and a bullet outside the box of Jeremy Bobasi. But right into the breadbasket of Jimmy Maurer. Of the fifth year man for San Jose, their talisman, Christian Espinosa. Espinosa drives it in, headed towards the back post, off the post and in! It is a goal for San Jose! It wasn't pretty, but the goal has been scored! Their first of the night! To putting the home team front 70 minutes into the game first of all quality service everyone well on side here a little bit of bouncing around Benji Kakanovich in the neighborhood Tanner Beeson and that ball just sneaking in the far post it bounces off of that far post but clearly crossing the line Tomasi should have cleared it but he looked as if he was trying to let it go to deflect he thought perhaps it was going to actually go beyond the post One more look. You see Tomasi there trying to let it go. Makes the wrong decision there. A fortunate four. And you're looking to create just one good chance in these final few moments. We know we've, they've done it before. As recently as the game of Austin. Yellow card, Velasco and Judson both. And so when he says he needs to be at his best, it's, a, it's also about him growing, him improving him becoming a better teacher, effective communicator, understanding the tactics and the development of the game as it progresses. Cross comes in from Alan Velasco, and hit it in, it's an equalizer! Jafari was up there, you pointed out a moment ago, Danielle is the target, and he is the target, and he's the goal scorer! 1-1, with just a couple of minutes of stoppage time remaining.
the Earthquakes have made a substitute in bringing in JT Marcinkowski. Everyone clearly on side, no pressure on the ball. Easy for Tafari to go up for that one. Daniel just caught a bit off of his line. You see him backing up there, trying to scramble, just perfectly headed toward the far post here. Rodriguez not tight enough to really put any sort of pressure. It's headed away, I believe, by Obreon. A swing and a miss by Judson. And there could be time for one last counterattack. San Jose slowed it up. Here's Velasco. Down he goes on the foul by Carlos Gresso. Yellow card for the San Jose Earthquakes defensive midfielder. Between an injury, a goal scored, a check after the goal. There were 10 minutes of stoppage time, right at 100 minutes. The game has ended at 1-1.